has been almost two years since the deadly heat dome in June of 2021 claimed more than 70 lives in Multnomah County and many more across the Pacific Northwest. Today, Multnomah County commissioners announced a lawsuit against some of the world's largest fossil fuel corporations, suing them for hundreds of millions of dollars for what they believe are their contributions to climate change and the deaths in the region. The resolution is adopted. <laughs> With that, Multnomah County commissioners agreed to file a lawsuit against 17 major fossil fuel and coal producing corporations over the deadly Pacific Northwest heat dome in 2021. A march toward justice as they seek $50 million in damages and $1.5 billion in future damages. With this action, we seek to hold these fossil fuel companies accountable for the damages that have arisen from one of the most deadly and destructive human-made weather disasters in American history. That disaster resulted in hundreds of deaths across the Pacific Northwest and temperatures up to 116 degrees in our region alone. The county believes harm from these corporations will only rise with time. According to the Oregon Climate Change Research Institute, the, green, the greenhouse gas emissions uh, continue at the current level. The annual temperature in Oregon is projected to increase by 5 degrees Fahrenheit by 2050 and 8.2 degrees Fahrenheit by 2080. The corporations include ExxonMobil, Shell, Chevron, ConocoPhillips, and more, and the cost to the county is contingent on whether they win the case. It's expected to take between five and ten years for a resolution, but county officials and their legal team say it's crucial for the future of the region. This county is charged with an awesome responsibility to safeguard the health, safety, and welfare of its people and of the property and our natural resources and everything else. We reached out to all 17 of the companies listed in the county's lawsuit. Some have responded, and you can read their statements on our website at kptv.com. Carly Olson, Fox 12 Oregon. Carly, thank you.